Hi, so this is a tutorial about how to improve the sound that you are sending through Zoom. If you have been experiencing something like no, somebody maybe doesn't understand what you're saying or your sound gets really, really cut off, then this might be the solution. Now, remember, it's always um, a set of solutions. Now, one of the things that I, I recommend is actually getting a microphone, but sometimes that's not possible. So if you don't, if you can't get a microphone, then there's one setting that you can change that's really going to help you get a better sound from Zoom. And that's the original sound mode. Now, the original sound is when, well, let's just uh, get something uh, clear. Zoom was meant to uh, video conferencing for speech and when it hears you talking, then the microphone opens up. And, and when you stop talking, then the, micro, the microphone shuts down. So that way you don't get a lot of the, uh, the background noises. If a dog's barking, if a door opens or things like this, they might not get caught by the microphone because it only picks up on speech. That's great for speech, but it's terrible for music. Now, that's how I found out about it, but you can use it to, to your advantage too, even if you're not a musician. So what you do is you log into your, uh, your app or your client. I'm gonna do it both from, webs, uh, from a desktop and from an, from an iPad. But for the iPad, it's very similar to Android, so you're going to be able to use them for both. And you click on your icon on the upper right corner, and it's going to show you the settings. You click on settings and then you click on audio right here. And then you look for this. Suppress background noise. I set it always to low. That's what I recommend you to do as well. And here is what's important. Show in meeting option to enable original sound. Now, as it says here, automatically disables noise suppression, removes high pass, so you hear everything. Everything that's around the room, you're going to hear. And that's a, that can be better, that can sometimes get in the way, so that's why it's very important to mute yourself when you are not talking. Okay, so I use high fidelity uh, music mode because I use music and I play music from my instrument. and. There are other things that I, that I use like echo cancellation and stereo audio, but I'm going to, but whenever you click on this one, when you are in the meeting, enable original sound, all this gets, well, the echo cancellation just gets knocked out of there. So you can hear everything, even the echo. Okay, so that's, and then when you, when, when you have that ready, then you're good to go. Remember, the first thing to do is to update. You need to update your Zoom client, whether it's in your desktop or in your iPad. Sometimes they don't uh, automatically update. So you gotta look for the update yourself to get the, the latest um, features. Okay, so that's how I did it on the desktop. Now let's try on the iPad. Same thing, you open up your, your app and now this time is in the lower left corner. Here are the settings. Click on those. You click then on meetings and you have right here audio, use original audio. You can click off and on, but I really, really advise you to turn it always to on. But remember, it's important to mute yourselves when you are not talking. That's rule number one. Um, okay. Now, let's see how that looks like inside the actual meeting. Let's start a new meeting. And when that begins, oh, this, this is always going to, this is gonna ask me that because I've been, uh, I've been using it. I've been, I just up, uh, updated it. So every time I update it, uh, it asks me again, those things. Um, Please join via Wi-Fi. Yes, okay. So, there I am now. And you can see here, nope, you can see. Yes, right there. In the three dots up here where it says more, you just click on that. You click enable original sound, and there you go. Now you have original sound on. So 
you're listening to the same thing that you are hearing. It's not the same quality as right now, what you're hearing through Zoom, but the microphones in your tablets, phones, or computers are really, really good. So if you change this setting, it's really going to help you. Well, that's it for me. If you have any questions, please don't forget to comment. All right, see you later.